What up, what up? It's your boy, though, King, and welcome to Dope King Vision. This is a channel where we do intuitive messages. Channel messages card pulling and all that shit. Good evening. Hope everyone's having a good evening. My evening is going fucking fantastic. Um, if you work today, I hope you got that course session with my nigga. I sure did. Um, it was pretty slow. You know what I mean? It's storming over this bitch, but it is what it is, though. Um, yeah, I hope y'all had a great day, though. If you didn't work today, I hope you connected to your inner child, bro. I hope you got some healing done, bro. Hope you connected to your children if you have any, bro. Um, that's very healing energy. <clears throat> Excuse me. But yeah, nigga, I ain't got too much to say, bro. We finna um, slide right into this bitch, bro. Uh, thank y'all so much for like, sharing, and subscribing, join the team, bro. Um, if these messages fucking resonate with you, then please hit that like button and subscribe if you have not. Um, them motherfucking comments that don't look like comments, if you see it, get it the fuck out of here. They don't look like regular comments, bitch. It's, it's a hedge, bro. These motherfuckers are fucking stupid. Also, uh, the reporting your comment shit, um, you can comment again if you see your shit disappear, bro. It's not me doing it, of course, bro. Um, people trying to stop the progress of this, you know, shit. Anyways, let's get it, bro. Fuck it. <clears throat> thank you, God. Thank you, Spirit. Thank you, ancestors. Thank you, Archangels. Thank you, regular angels. Thank you, Spirit, guys, for keeping the collective protected moving forward, bro. In the right mind space, bro. Uh, getting that confusion the fuck out of here. Thank you so much for everything. Um... Please keep us protected, bro. Please keep our energy high, bro, so we can bounce that bullshit right back. Thank you so much for everything. Um, I can't stress it enough, bro. It's only getting better. We know that it's coming. Thank you so much. Uh, please protect the collective in their sleep, man. And then I shit, let's fucking get in, man. All right, bro. Yeah, bro. <laughs> Hip hop queen to uh, pull overall, bro. Go in with the chakra wisdom tarot, bro. I don't wish to fucking um same shit as this nigga and clarify what this is the reality. Uh secrets of tarot for anybody. Yeah. My bad y'all. It's been a long day, bro. But fuck it. <laughs> I love connecting the water shit like that. Y'all know um I be walking and shit, bro. I, I soaked in a bitch, bro. Like what the fuck? Bro? Like, um Yeah, got through it, bro. It is what it is, bro. Oh, uh, we finna find out what spirit wants you to know this evening, my nigga. We don't declare to another this evening, man. Let's get it, bro. Let's go, bro. We don't declare to another this evening, spirit. We have Rhapsody. Mm -hmm. Spirit wants you to know the truth this evening. Someone wants you to know the truth this evening. Nigga, you are the truth, my nigga. We are the truth, my nigga. Um, team Dope in this bitch, bro. You already know, bro. Uh, I don't know what the mother channel is really be on, but we really heal over here, bro. And it shows, my nigga. The fuck you talking about, bro? Yeah. But that ass, though, <laughs> you could be receiving the truth from somebody. Someone wants to bring the truth to you, or you could just be speaking your own truth, bro. You like, fuck it, nigga. Gotta. Say what needs to be said, type shit, bro. And that's honestly the nigga. You see me doing it, nigga. Dead ass, bro. Like fuck that, bro. Fuck it, bro. That's the whole reason all this bullshit was able to go on in the world in the first place, cause niggas were being too humble. Niggas won't speak it up. Niggas won't. You know what I mean? Yeah, you know I mean it is what it is, bro. Let's go, dog. I miss y'all. Love y'all, niggas, bro. <clears throat> Finding it hard to speak the truth right now. Oh damn! <laughs> but uh, this represents honesty, straightforwardness, comprehension, and stubbornness, bro. Yeah, somebody definitely could be be being stubborn. They could feel like you are, or you could be. We gonna get into it, bro. You already know. Um, but yeah, you're finding it hard to speak the truth right now. Maybe you're sparing the feelings of others, or you aren't quite sure how to put the words together, bro. It's a struggle we all deal with, though. Like Rhapsody's card proves the truth shall set you free, my nigga. Um, open your throat chakra and let the words come out. Remember, we can experience blockages of all kinds and not speaking your truth can feel metaphorically strangling, dog. Real shit. Sometimes eloquence just, I mean, must. 
<laughs> take a backseat to being brutally honest, nigga. And that's why you see me being brutally honest, nigga. I don't fuck around, bro. Eloquence is all good, bro. And I mean, being a very eloquent individual, bro, you want to say the right things, but you don't want to step on anybody's toes. But guess what, nigga? Nine times out of ten, bro, if you ain't stepping on this person's toes, then you probably stepping on that person. Do you get what I'm saying, bro? It doesn't fucking matter. You need to go with your heart or what you need to do. That's it, nigga. Um, not no bullshit, though, bro. I like this. I like the fact that the spirit is bringing that shit right there. Someone in your energy could be uh, finding it hard to speak some type of truth, though. But it's something that we all deal with, bro. That throat chakra, bro. You know what I mean? Somebody's throat chakra could be closed, bro. Um having trouble speaking up or just in the simple fact like they have reasons for not doing it maybe that person doesn't have the right words and the motherfucker need to get it together i guess bro what the fuck like one thing i never got was like okay you ain't got the right words though but what are you doing to find the right words though that's what that's what's confusing to me about a lot of situations nigga because how the fuck it take you not nigga for me even a fucking nigga a day or two how the fuck you ain't found the words in a day or two what else was you doing that you I mean, didn't speak up. You got niggas that be waiting years to say some shit, bro, that are like, what? Yeah, you got me fucked up. That's what you got. <laughs> nah, no bullshit. Bro. But yeah, though, <laughs> for real, for real. Um, somebody could be sparing the feelings of others. I feel like it's more so with that than anything else. It would have to be right, bitch, because if you want to if you wanna tell somebody that you love them, then you're going to say that shit. How the hell is it hurting? So anyways, let, let, we going to keep it moving. Um, Thank you, Spirit, for that. Yeah, someone missing you, bro. But they don't know how to tell you that they miss you, that they love you, shit like that. Whatever, nigga. Um, that's a personal fucking problem, if you ask me. Uh, anyways, nigga, fuck. Um, yeah, clarify that. What's going on, Spirit? Thank you for that. What's going on? Please give me clear and precise messages for my collective, man. Thank you so much for everything, dog. Someone's having trouble speaking, bro. What the fuck? <laughs> it just came out now, right, bro? The first one was to reunite with you. It's my reunion card, bro. Or at least one of them, bro. And this person wants to reunite, bro. Um, but they're not fucking saying anything, bitch. Okay. Okay, nigga. Like, what? Should I end the read here, guys? Like, no bullshit, bro. This ain't nothing new. That's what I'm saying, bro. Like, hey, if you know on this channel, bro, you know me to like, like, new shit, nigga. And sending the old ass energy, bro. You got trouble speaking up, bitch. We gonna find out why, of course, y'all. But I'm just saying, oh, this person could have stole from you, bro. Or they were being sneaky in the past, bro. We gonna get into it, though, bro. I'm gonna keep it fuck with you. Nostalgia, bro. Childhood, good memories, bro. This is an old friendship or relationship resuming, bro. We visited in the past, bro. Sudden good luck, bro. Someone taking care of you. Someone being lovesick. Yeah, bro. I feel like that lovesick ass energy, bro. Sitting there looking fucking dumb as fuck. Look at that bitch fit in this. <laughs> what the fuck? People love being nostalgic over shit, bro. Reminiscing over old memories instead of making new, better ones, nigga. You know what that comes with? That's growth. If old people are growing, bro, I mean, it is what it is. Some people be stuck in the past, bro, because of completely other shit that ain't got nothing to do with you, bro. And, um, Gotta hold them back as well, dog. And that's perfectly fucking fine. Was again, personal fucking issue, bro. You know what I mean? Yeah, I'm not trying to be insensitive at all. And y'all know me. Y'all know I'm not. But at the end of the day, it's kind of like, what the fuck, nigga? You just gonna sit there like that, bro? You know what I mean, bro? That's on you. Like, that's how I honestly feel about it. Clarify that, bro. Damn. Okay. <laughs> Stupid ass one car shit, bro. Shit about to get on my nerves already, bro. We got the nine of coins coming out now, right? My bad, y'all. I shouldn't even be in no irritant energy, bro. I feel like since I made that post, bro, someone's sending me conflict energy. Someone's uh, trying to pipe me up and shit, bro. But that's fine, bro. Um, at least y'all know that I know and that I can identify for y'all, bro. <laughs> What's up, though? Yeah, bro, we got independent self-reliance, bro. This is increasing wealth, bro. Spiritual independence. This is a new business deal of some kind, bro. Um, this is the change of residence, travel, bro, fruits and Rewards, luxury, treat yourself. You've earned it, my nigga. So, someone's nostalgic. I mean, this could be anybody from your past, to be honest, y'all. Like, it could be, um, like I said, old friend, could be family, shit like that. Someone's dissatisfied about you moving on to this. And, um, 
who fucking cares? Once again, nigga, you're growing nine. You're growing like you're growing and all right, bro. This person ain't nigga. Okay, bro. Okay, bro. Um, once again, not trying to be insensitive to anybody, but like I, okay, bro. <laughs> Let's see though. I feel like this person wants to bring you the truth that they miss you, bro. They probably want to travel towards you, bro. This is traveling and shit like that. Change your residence. They probably want to move towards you or move with you, bro. Honestly, bro. Whoever this is, new business deal, bro. They could want to work with you, bro. That could be the truth as well. <sighs> Clarify the nine of coins. Fucking ass energy right now, bro. We got the oh man. <laughs> Alright. We got the Knight of Cups on reverse. Alright, no. I, I, okay, okay. Never mind. Let me go ahead and <laughs> run that shit for y'all, bro. We got the Five of Swords in the reverse. Op ass energy, bro. This is jealous ass op ass energy, bro. People who are jealous of your knight of coins, I feel like maybe spirit wants to tell you that, or somebody else wants to tell you that. Spirit is definitely telling you to be patient, bro. Facts. Or someone could want to bring you the truth about people being, man, hold on. Yeah, bro, you know, working on your shit. This is fruits of your labor, bro. Balancing out your finances, balancing out your shit, bro. Working on your shit, planting your seeds, my nigga. Putting the coins in reverse, bro, could be a mother figure, bro. I just feel like it's more so smothering, nosy ass on, dick ass fucking energy, bro, to be completely real. And um, this could be your mother, bro. I told you Six of Cups, that's childhood memories, bro. Um, or a mother figure to y'all, uh, for those of you who just slide into this motherfucking shit, bro. Or this person could just have a child in general that's in the reverse energy, to keep it a bit. Uh, we got Sag energy out this bitch, Sagittarius or whatever, bro, with the Temperance nigga. So this could be a Sag that's fucking an op, nigga. Seven of coins that is playing seeds and shit like that, working on shit, bro. So you could work with this damn Sag if someone wants to bring you to the mother. I don't even necessarily think that, though. I, I, I'm feeling like the mother energy because you got the Six of Cups on there. The mother probably wants to reunite with you because this bitch are op. And I mean, we're not going to forget that. The bitch jealous and shit. Bitch immature. This is immature ass energy, nigga. Hold on, nigga. Oh, okay. We got short term affair energy, bro. Uh, Chatterbox moodiness, bro. Disappointment over not wanting, I mean, not getting what they want. This is bratty ass energy, bro. You got people from your past that are bratty over not being able to work with you now. They see you playing your season and balancing your life out. I think I already said that shit. And um, you being patient with yourself, being patient with your, you know, your process, nigga. And that's fucking awesome, nigga. But don't be too damn patient or you're going to be, you know, procrastinating, nigga. That's how, you know, it's a thin line between shit. Balance, dog. But yeah, this is a thief, my nigga. To keep it a stack, bro. Uh, okay, okay. I got it now, bro. So, I don't even necessarily think anybody wants to bring you the truth necessarily. I mean, maybe, maybe this bitch wanted to bring you the truth, bro. Hold on. Hold on. If it's obvious energy, this is motherfucking um, betrayal, bro, deception, bullying, bro, walking away. Okay, someone could be walking away from a jealous individual as well and then telling you the truth about this person. You know what I mean? Hold on. Uh, hollow victories, bro. Yeah, bro, I feel like this person experienced a hollow victory, whatever the fuck this dumb motherfucker did, and they are mad that they didn't get what they... Wanted out of the situation, so they're in a brat ass energy, bro. Uh, Queen of Coins in reverse, maybe even pertaining in that energy, bro. Take what I said at first about the mother figure, bro. I feel like that's kind of true, too. You know what I mean? Um, but I feel like you had to leave this motherfucker behind. <laughs> Honestly, bro, it could be an earth sign, Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo energy, bro. Um, but you had to leave this person out on the go. You're not uh, bringing no stable commitment to this motherfucker anymore. Maybe just a simple fact that you may feel betrayed because. I mean, whether it's a male or female, you already know what time it is on my channel, bro. Whether it's a uh, male or female, this person betrayed you in some type of way, or you may just feel that way, bro. Or this person fucking knows that, nigga. And this person um, was in like a... I mean, this is codependent energy, bro. So they could have been codependent on something or somebody. For real, for real. They could have experienced a hollow... I mean, yeah, a hollow victory or something by walking away from your ass, right, bro? But they look... Hold on. Oh, 
Hold on. Clarify that for other stories. We got Leo energy out of this. Not out this gym, but you know what time it is, bro. But the three of cups, bro. All right, bro. They got betrayed by their friends, nigga, that were jealous and shit. Maybe. Or, nigga, you could feel like this person um, betrayed you to go, you know, fuck with friends and shit. This is also like a short-term affair and shit like that. So this person may have wanted a short-term affair with you, bro. Hold on, bro. I got you. That was like a hollow victory, bro, to try to have a, a night out with you or some shit. Hold on, bro. I got y'all. I got y'all, bro. Community, friends, happiness, joint company, celebration. Yeah, like I said, bro. Oh, this person was in the never zone, just wanted to go celebrate and shit. Okay, I got it. I got it. You're not fucking with this motherfucker. You don't want a long term commitment with this motherfucker no more, right? Boom. You working on yourself and balancing out your life. I got y'all, niggas. Boom. Thank you, spirit. Um, Nah, you did that because this motherfucker either, either came off as somebody who just wanted a short-term affair, and this is also a chatterbox on some shit. This person was probably being moody and shit, nigga. And then as far as that chatterbox energy, bro, you probably already knew that this person was running their mouth about you to people around them, to these motherfuckers, bro. You know what I mean? The people that they, you know, party with, whatever the case, the seven of coins are sticking out, so it could be a worse situation involved, but whatever, nigga. That person just wanted to do that, or you may have felt that way. You may feel that way currently, even in that case, bro. Um, yeah, bro, you could feel like this person just wanted to go uh, do their thing. You feel me, bro? You let that motherfucker go do their thing. That's how I'm seeing that, bro. Um, and that's fucking good, bro. <laughs> what the fuck? People don't want to shut, like, bro. Anyways, uh, yeah, because it's just friends friend energy. Got betrayed by their friends, bro. I feel like it was a hollow victory for this person doing all that motherfucking Man, give me this shit, bro. Clarify that Knight of Cups in reverse, bro. I already know. I told you. Nigga, thank you, Spirit. I just said that, though. You already knew what the fuck was going on, bro. You already knew. You trusted your intuition in the situation regarding this person, bro. That's literally what this card is speaking to me as, bro. I feel like as well, bro. This is a mysterious individual. Let me read it for y'all, niggas, bro. A mysterious person, bro. A well-respected person in the community and shit like that. People probably go to this person. I'm probably go to you for advice and shit like that, bro. Whatever, bro. Uh, you could be a spiritual individual. Well, duh, you on this channel, but I mean, like a spiritualist of sorts, bro. You could be. Um, yeah, bro. This is a powerful individual, bro. An intuitive person, bro. Um, unconscious. You know what I mean, they listen to their inner voice, bro. Uh, perceptive, never wrong, bro. Because you know, we speak on shit we know. You may not say much, but when we do speak, bitch. Anyways, uh, <laughs> they trust they got feelings, bro. You know what I mean? Uh, there's more than meets the eye to this person, bro. I feel like thou, nigga. That's just that, nigga. I feel like, I feel like, boom, right. Hold on, I got you, bro. I got you, bro. Yeah, you trusted your intuition in regards to this person for sure. You know what I mean? You you seen the energy, bro, for what it was, bro. You didn't let this person get that fucking um water fountain, bro, or that magic stick. You already know, bro. You ain't let that person come get that shit because you felt like this person was on some bullshit. Like I just feel, I just feel like that's that, bro. And even oh shit, even vice versa for some of y'all, bro. This person allowed their friends to allow their jealous ass motherfucking friends to motherfucking um because you was a mysterious person, bro. So they may have um been on some shit, like bro. I feel like nah. I feel like it's a reason that shit came out, bro. I feel like you knew what the fuck this person too bro so you just left that shit you walked away from the shit and that's that nigga um that's that nigga let me qu man clarify the uh three of cups please hold on so it does go on tenor with what i was saying bro so you being that mysterious individual bro that you know, you don't say, my bro, you be to yourself, bro. You know shit, so you don't say shit, bro. If it's anything, bro, you read the energy, bro, and you stay to yourself, by, by the way, my nigga. Like, so you may know a whole bunch of shit about people, bro. You don't give a fuck, nigga. It ain't your life. You feel what I'm saying, bro? Duh, nigga, it ain't your life. Bro, 
just into their lives, you know. You, you ain't you a toxic motherfucker. I'm gonna just stay my ass away from you. You know what I mean? Um, but I ain't gonna judge you or nothing, but people go through life, and that's how we progress forward in life. And shit. Uh, that person allowed people that were misjudging you to begin with that you ain't even fucking about to allow them to misjudge you as well. And that's just pretty much that. That's pretty much that. 2020, bro. I just said that, bro. For some of y'all, this could have been in regards to a situation in the past. 2020 could be significant, but what I'm saying is, nigga, you saw right through this motherfucker. You saw, you saw what was going on, bro. Yeah, just clarified it, bro. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So yeah, they, they might feel betrayed by their friends, so now they're depressed. And they're also feeling like they feeling, you know what I mean? They in a brat ass energy, but I'm gonna keep it a stack, bro. You know what I mean? And then it just goes into shit like they were talking, because this is a chat about, they were talking about you. They just was talking about you to their friends, nigga. And their friends probably told them to walk away from your ass. You know what I mean? Short term affair shit, but they probably told them motherfuckers to just, told that motherfucker to just, you know, have that type of relationship with you, if anything. Or like I said, nigga, they said that you was, you be out, you know what I mean? Doing whatever is, nigga, you feel me, bro? But the motherfucker left him like this, bitch. Whoever this is, bitch. Hold on, dog. But ain't that sad, bro? You know what I mean? That shit sad as a bitch. This is negativity, bro. Their friends are negative as fuck. And they made this person walk away from you, but it was a hollow victory, bro. Won't that, won't that. You the fuck, nigga? So, you know what I mean? Nigga, what the fuck? And then that shit left that motherfucker feeling bratty, nigga. Like, oh my God, y'all told me to walk away and he was going to chase, she was going to chase. No, the fuck, what, nigga? Where does that ever make sense, bitch? Anyway. That's the story, y'all. That's what was going on in this little shit. Hold on. Because I want to, I want to, hold on. <laughs> you avoided a tower from fucking with this motherfucker. You seen through him, bro? This little party girl, party boy energy, bro. I just feel like at the end of the day, man, let me clarify this queen of coins real quick. Queen of coins in reverse. Please clarify that. 2222, 22, bro. Um, I mean, that's balance energy. Balance, balance to stability energy. I just feel like the friends lied to this person and said that you were not stable. You were not good to build a home with, bro. Said that you were like on the codependent shit, blah, 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 bitch. You know what I mean? You got Leo energy, Sag energy, bro. That could be two signs that were involved, bro. Or you could be one of those signs, my nigga. Or female, you know what I mean? Um, we got Pisces right here as well, bro. So take that shit as you may. A Pisces could be involved, bro. Some injustice. Libra could be involved. Who gives a fuck, nigga? Who gives a fuck, nigga? Like dead ass, bro. Y'all gotta be trying to tell you, y'all like fucking with these bitch ass niggas, bro. Like, I feel like y'all females be. I'm just saying, I'm sorry, bro. Because, like, bro, I'm being real, bro. Divine males that, especially be on this shit, bro, don't even be feeling the need to comment like that. Unless it's about, like, the family and all that shit, bro. When it comes to this relationship shit, no, we know what the fuck is up already, bro. It be y'all that need to get y'all fucking mind out of the motherfucking, out of that bullshit, bro. Like, everybody ain't like, you know what I mean? Such and such, bro. And to be honest, bro, a lot of y'all, bro, I'm gonna keep it a real stat with y'all real quick, nigga, because a lot of you, I'm sorry to the reader, not fuck y'all. Anyway, look, bro, these readers be having y'all niggas, bro. Like, in these cycles for years, bro. Literally, bro. Like, what the fuck? A lot of y'all are like older, older, bro, or getting there, bro. Y'all not gonna get nobody if you continue to act the way you act, bro. Stop letting these bitches tell you you're an empress, bro. You're a page, nigga. You're a knight, nigga. Facts, nigga. The fuck you talking about, bro? <laughs> nigga, it don't matter that you got kids or not, bitch. You still not. You a kid raising a kid, bro. Grow up. Get your shit together, dog. Not trying to come at nobody. And if you know I'm not talking to you, then you know I'm not talking to you. At the same time, bro, don't just block the shit out. Because you don't want to hear what the fuck I'm saying, nigga. Because you're going to end up missing out on your whole life. And guess what, bitch? You're coming back another lifetime to do it. And that's what the agenda is. You be forgetting. These readers be getting paid, bro. To keep y'all on that wrong fucking path. To keep y'all in these cycles with motherfuckers that's going to steal from you. Do all this, bro. The ideology that I spoke on the last video. The whole ideology of you got to stay with the motherfucker you had kids with. But it was a reason why the tower happened on that bullshit. And you had to separate. Y'all talking about co-parenting, all right, bro? Like, I keep trying to tell y'all niggas that exchange of money, nigga, the exchange of words alone, da 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 da, da. I understand. For some of y'all, y'all have to communicate, duh. I am saying, though, at the same time, bro, if you truly, bro, I'm just, 
right? And y'all see what I, y'all will see what I mean. As the relationship between you and that motherfucker will never continue to get better, bro. If anything, it's just gonna get more childish or that mother, you just gonna feel more obligated to be attached to that person. That is an attachment. Nigga, y'all claim to be intuitive, y'all know all this energy shit, bitch. Y'all just gonna neglect it for that motherfucker, right? Oh, there's an exception, bitch. Oh, you're it just don't apply to that motherfucker or you, right, bro? Okay, bro. Okay, bro. I'm just being real, nigga. <laughs> y'all be wondering why your life not changing. Why you so confused about this, that, and the third, bro? Y'all be having spells put on you, nigga. Y'all got to break them shits, nigga. I ain't trying to come for nobody. Y'all know I'm not, bro. I'm just being real, uh, real as a bitch, <laughs> as always. Sorry, bro. Not sorry, though, bro. I have to tell y'all this, bro. Like, that is why I was put up here, bro, to be completely honest. Like, shit like this, I can't not say it. You know what I mean? I can't not say it, bro, because y'all need to know that, bro. Fuck. All this bullshit, nigga. Like, some of the, bro, to be honest with you, like, with the last motherfucker, bro, not even last for a lot of y'all, it was that little situation, but for some of y'all, probably wasn't, probably was, like, a white figure or anything, but it doesn't really matter, bro. That mother figure and who you would presume as your twin, you know what I mean? Whatever, bro. Uh, what was I about to say? Oh, yeah, bro. I've heard this shit so much in my life, bro. <laughs> like, if, if, if he doesn't love your mom, then he doesn't love you. What the fuck, bro? How did, what, nigga? Bro, and, and, and a lot of motherfuckers really go by that and end up fucking losing great people because of that dumb ass shit, bro. <laughs> and again, talk to by a narc, nigga. That's that narc empath shit, though. And y'all got to learn about that instead of sitting here fucking going in circles. All, man, man, I'm sorry, bro. Like, I'm sorry to those who feelings I may be hurting by saying this shit, bro, but it's the truth, bro. A lot of y'all are codependent, can't be without somebody in your life, but you got kids for that bitch. And to be honest, if a lot of y'all feel like y'all would have to leave the kids behind, bro, guess what, bro? It's the reason why you're getting that download, bro. Like, sometimes, bro, you got to understand that your, it's your journey, bro. All this surface-ass shit, bro. Nigga, didn't your mom turn on you, bro? Didn't your people turn on you, bro? Like, it's a soul thing, bro. It's a past life to this lifetime type shit, nigga. They'll follow you into this lifetime. Be your mom, be your si be your motherfucking, your whole family, bro. Trying to take you the fuck out, bro. Just like they did last lifetime, bro. Like, I'm sorry, bro. But I'm not sorry. Y'all niggas need to know this shit, bro. Like, damn, bro. <laughs> oh, shit. Because, like, at the end of the day, bro, you can take it how you take it, nigga. Life still gonna go on, you know, whatever, bro. If you're content with where the fuck you are in life and are cool staying there, that's what wonderful, nigga. You're gonna die there. And then that, I mean, shit, that's where your soul's growth is, bitch. I don't know. I mean, I don't really give a fuck, bro. I'm on, I'm on this bitch to help people grow. Let's go. What the fuck, bro? <laughs> no, nigga. Not saying like, oh, just abandon anybody or blah, 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 blah. Some shit. Yeah, bitch. Yeah, but I'm saying like kid wise and shit. Like, nah. Of course not, bro, but that's for you to go within and think about, not go to outside sources such as bitches that don't even know where the fuck they stand in the spiritual realm or even on the physical realm. A lot of these bitches, bro, that been up here, bro, yes, bro, yeah, they made a career out of the tarot shit, bro. That's their career. That's awesome and shit, right? What the fuck else can you do, bro? What else can you do? I mean, I understand, like, being in a purpose and trying to help people, but most of these bitches got these gifts and got them up here and just are gossiping. Cut the video off before they even take you anything else, bro. Like, what the fuck? You just sitting there like, well, shit, I already knew that. And then you stuck in the same cycle, bitch. What the fuck, nigga? What you gonna do? What you gonna do about it, nigga? Like, that's how... That's, bro, you gonna get that on this channel, bro. Or at least I'm gonna try to help, bro. I'll tell you what I did if I come across a situation that I was in that. You know what I mean? Boom, boom. And then when we get in them damn lives, bro, we gonna be lit in a bitch in them motherfuckers, bro. That way I can talk back to y'all niggas. You can type me. You know what I mean? But we got to get to that 1.5, bro. Fuck all that, bro. You see this energy dissipating, right, nigga? That mean gifts are getting stronger, bitch. Mine included, nigga. Yeah, bitch. Sitting, sitting all that shit. Right back, bitch. You ain't fucking with a nigga, bro. And you ain't fucking with my team, bro. So if you're not subscribed, bro, because my prayer, bro, to be honest, I'm praying over my team, bitch. I'm praying for the whole collective as well. You already know. But the ones that know you're protected by me, by this channel, bro, that is energy. If you're not subscribed, bitch, you probably... I mean, I'm just being real, bro. That's not a ploy. And I'm pretty sure if you really watch tarot or whatever, bro, I haven't even, nigga, I've only been watching tarot for like a, what, a year and a half now, bro. Facts, nigga. And that's included with me doing tarot for almost half a year now, bro. It's been about five months, nigga. You see how fucking, bro, 
Y'all bitches need to tap. Not sorry. I'm sorry, bro. But it's literally like, bro, do y'all want to? Hey, nigga, it's not a game no more, bro. This world is changing whether you want to change or not, whether you want to grow or not, bro. It is, nigga. I said it when I started my channel five months ago, bro. Energy fucking, bro. That was when the energy shift happened, nigga. It's either you're on the good side or the bad side. You want to keep acting like you don't know good from bad? Nigga, even kids know good from bad. You want to keep acting like you know you don't know good from bad, bitch? God don't need you on up here, bro. God don't need you here, bro. Facts, nigga. You ain't trying to help shit. You just want to sit in my... Nigga, even if you do got gifts, bitch, and you want to be stingy with them, nigga, you ain't trying to help nobody out in your own life. None of that shit, bro. Yeah, bro, you gonna get that shit snatched, nigga. We don't need you for that. We don't need you for that. The fuck, nigga, if you are called... I mean, what I, nigga, many are called, few are chosen, bitch. Facts, nigga. And it shows all the motherfucking time. A lot of these bitches were called to do tarot, and that's probably why they ain't getting messed with, bro. They probably served their, you know, karma and, you know, built their shit in the last lifetime. They get to chill and do this this lifetime. You never know, bro. That's why I try not to judge. But I do know a karmic when I see a motherfucking karmic. I do know sick-ass energy when I see that. Y'all could take me popping like this for anything you want and not listen to what the fuck is coming out my mouth, bro. But uh, it don't change the facts, nigga. It don't change the motherfucking truth, nigga. And that's exactly why I spit had this come out, because I... He wanted me to pop, bro. Like, he wanted me to do this, bro. Not like that. Not no bad nature. But that's like, bro, I'm so passionate about this, bro. Because it's so common sense and so easy, nigga. But I ain't going to hold y'all niggas um, too long, bro. I'm sorry, bro. But I'm not sorry, though. I'm just sorry for the... If it's offending anybody, bro. Because that's not what I'm doing it for, bro. But it's uh, imperative to know, bro. A lot of this shit, bro, you be sitting here getting snaked by motherfuckers that you think you're supposed to be attached to. What, nigga? A lot of y'all niggas... Have it very confused of what y'all want from what y'all need in y'all life, bro. Because y'all don't want something so bad you think you fucking need it, nigga. I right, bro. Why, shit, you never have it. I bet you that. What the hell, nigga? Anyways, I'm sorry, bro. Clarifying the Queen of Coins in the reverse, bro. Is the Five of Cups in the upright, bro? The Four of Wands in the upright, bro? The Page of Wands in the upright, bro? And the Eight of Swords in the upright, bro? And that's what the... Um, shit, I was... Nigga, your, your mother going to motherfucking jail, nigga. Yes, nigga. She taking a she taking a quick trip there, nigga. You know, she taking a quick trip. You know what I mean? <clears throat> You're having a happy home within the situation, bro. And this motherfucker is, is losing, bro. I'm man, this is death in my book, bro. And all right, bro. But it could just be like lost grief and despair of the individual, bro. Because you're still in the happy home, you're still in this motherfucking energy. You feel me, bro? I'm building your fucking shit. You know what I mean? Just playing your seeds and shit like that, bro. And and the other deck, nigga, and one of these, uh, any other deck, for real, for real, with the seven of coins, bro, it's, it's the nigga looking at the bush and shit. That bitch is actually touching the coin. She's working on it. You know what I mean? She ain't looking at them and seeing what's going on, bro. She's actually doing it. Um, come on, yeah, I got y'all. I'm sorry for that, for real, bro. But I... <sighs> It's real shit, bro. We we supposed to be changing this damn world, bro. You can't do it sitting there. And like I said, bro, you want to be stick like that shit. Doing shit for the wrong reasons, bro. Hopping on shit just because you see somebody else doing it and it's popular, whatever the fuck, bro. I didn't do this because it was popular or none of that shit, bro. I literally, nigga, didn't even know why Spirit told me to even start doing this, nigga. Like, but no, of course I know now. I do know now, nigga. But I'm saying like <laughs> that that night when I grabbed them down playing cards and. Fucking took them notes and did that shit. I was like, what the fuck? Like, I'm really tapped in with motherfucking just diamonds and clubs and all that shit, nigga. Okay, let's get it, nigga. The very next day. And you can go to my first video, bro. I told, I, nigga, my story will never switch up, bitch. It's the truth. The fuck, nigga? That's exactly what the fuck happened. Nigga, <laughs> like, dead ass, nigga. I had never touched the tarot. Nigga. I didn't even touch the tarot card until about, like, my first deck was the Labyrinth deck. And, um, it's a, oh, it's right here, but yeah, bro, that was my first deck and shit. OG's oh, channel, know what's up, bro. And yeah, I started really getting it in with them bitches. And you know, time just went on to progress, bro. I guess, bro. Um, someone's in the energy of <laughs> wanting to travel forward, bro. They feel like they self sabotage themselves, bro, within a situation, bro. Take what I said about your mother, though. Yeah, that's definitely in here, bro. Or a mother figure to you, bro. Facts, um. Yeah, this, this dumb motherfucker, listen. Sorry. 
fart watcher, bro. But you dumb as hell, bro. For not, you know what I mean? Using your own intuition, bro. You ain't even give it a motherfucking chance, bro. For a lot of them, they didn't at all. Nigga just was like, oh, okay. <laughs> but honestly, the way I'm seeing it is not, nah, bro. This person was in a party and ass energy, bitch. With they fucking depressed ass friends. And now they depressed too. You know why? Because that's energy, bitch. And they keep being around. Like, bro, niggas don't understand that. I mean, it's okay, bro. Like, I don't want no shit. Is in despair because you're still happy, bro. You, you know what I mean, I don't. Hold on. Goal achieve rest from action, bro. Community home, community and home again, nigga. This could be a whole community of individuals, bro. But it's more celebratory energy, just like this would say. Like they could see, they could see you making new friends and shit. I don't fucking know, bro. Hold on, because <laughs> the page of wands and the upright, bro. That's you know, um, like leadership, aspiration, but you can have a second chance of money coming towards you. And it's gonna lead to you building your happy home. Okay, I see it like that. You see how she's looking at the home? She got that one wand, bro. But it's gonna be four when she. You know what I mean, that's what's up. I can see that. And someone's got them trapped in their head now. This, that, and the third, because. Okay, because they want to come build a happy home with you, bro, but you, you know what I mean? You done, that's emotional loss, nigga. You, you're not, you don't have emotions for the person like that no more, if you even have any, to keep, keep it a beam. Clarify to say the source and I write it. Because <laughs> I want to see something, bro. Because I mean, for a lot of Satisfied, bro. Dissatisfied as hell, bro. But I mean, I, I'm looking at that bratty ass energy. I just feel like cross watch you shouldn't have fucking ran your mouth, bitch. Like, what's wrong with your dumb ass? Like, and then a lot, because I'm just speaking for myself, bro. In my life, it be females, nigga. Yeah, it, God, nigga. Y'all love telling your best friends and blah, 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 blah. I mean, I don't really know about the nigga aspect because I don't do that shit, nigga. That, that's bitch ass nigga behavior, to be honest, nigga. But y'all do that shit and then wonder why. You don't end up with the motherfucker, bro. And the motherfucker end up moving forward on your ass, bitch. And then a lot of y'all are the masculine in this motherfucker because y'all want to keep doing shit like that, bro. And y'all don't even realize it, bitch. That shit's crazy as fuck, bro. Y'all don't even fucking realize it, bro. Getting on the shit, you fucking see. I see a female in the car, so it's a female. Y'all fucking dumb as a bitch. Like, what the fuck? It's a male in the car, so it's a male. Yo. Them bitches don't even understand energy. And I need y'all to understand... When the motherfucker don't even know what they're talking about when they're just saying some shit, bro. So you can get out of that confused ass energy, bro. What the fuck, bro? You will leave every read with some part of you will learn certain something new in this motherfucker. Every read, nigga. I never like I try not to repeat the same shit every bro. If you go down all my reads, I'm telling you every one of them different, nigga. In some way, shape, or form, bro, you'll learn something different, nigga, because I, I bro. Fuck it, nigga. I don't even be knowing what I'm going to talk about when I get on this bitch, but I got the abundance of knowledge to get y'all niggas when I see it, though. Whatever y'all need to hear at the moment, nigga. Um, yeah, nigga. <laughs> what the fuck? Anyways, nigga, yeah, bro. In the press, the ass energy. Let me see this real quick. Yeah, lock in the joy, bro. Don't worry about the haters, bro. <laughs> it's what this card tells you to do, bro. And I feel like this person was. Or they are, nigga. Because I feel like at this point, this motherfucker know that the people around them are hating. Whoever this is, bro, it could be multiple people. Like I said, nigga. Nigga know the people hating, nigga. And still, they're self-sabotaging, bro. They ain't saying shit, nigga. Ain't even, not, you know what I mean? Nigga, bitch, you a bitch. You know what I mean? I'm just saying, cuz. Just saying, cuz. What's the, what the fuck? Somebody gonna wanna fight your ass because you say, no, I like the person, nigga. What the fuck? Somebody gonna fight your ass because you say, no, you're actually wrong about the individual. How is it even that deep? Like, why the fuck is the collective name in your fucking mouth so much, nigga? Take the balls out your fucking throat, dog. Like, I'm sorry, y'all, bro. Like, but that, bro, this is why people don't fuck with me, nigga. Because, I, bro, I'm like this in real life, nigga. I don't give a fuck. Not like that, bro. I'm not disrespectful at all, bro. I'm very eloquent. Like I said, bro. You just have to get to know me to know me, bro. But when I'm, I have no tolerance for dumbass shit, nigga. I mean, bro, I mean, shit. Yeah. Personified, bro. I provide structure, bro. And I make sure that the structure is around me. I don't give a fuck 
what you do in your own life. But when you around me, bitch, it's certain shit you not about to do. Where you can get the fuck away from me. I ain't even got to argue with you. I'm not about to fight your dumb ass nigga. We just go separate. You're going to be the only one hurt from it, bitch. That's it, nigga. The fuck? Let me, oh. <laughs> Yo, let me pipe the fuck down, y'all. Sorry, y'all. Let me grab my shit real quick, bro. Goddamn 40 minutes into the video, nigga. We ain't even find out who legitimately this is, bro. But I feel like y'all know who it is, to be honest, bro. I feel like at any day, this person's gonna be depressed and fucking judge the mother figure, bro. That's what this is like over here, bro, because I done already split this shit up a little bit and shit like that, bro. So, like, because you walked away from your mother, bro, the bitch a brat. The bitch, like, oh my God. <laughs> like, bitch, what? Okay, wait, hold up. Thank you, God. Thanks for that. Thank you, y'all, because I know um, y'all been sending me this energy to find shit out, bro. Because a lot of this shit, bro. Some of this shit ain't, you know, even resonate with me like that. That's how I know I'm put, like I'm getting energy like that. Like, so I'm trying to broaden it for y'all niggas, bro. So this could definitely be just someone with kids, bro, or a kid, bro. It's in your energy that's on some fuck shit, bro. On some complete fuck shit. Um, yeah, let's get it. Uh, why? Who the fuck is this? Let's, yeah, who is this? Yeah, no people like that. We got you out here. And then we got your mother out here. Or your mother figure, bro. I feel like also this is pointing to something. Never mind. Let's go. Yeah, let's go. Who is this figure? This could be a long read, bro. I keep getting hella cards, bro. All right, but we got every card in the fucking reverse, bro. And I knew what time it was, bitch. All right, bro, so it could be your parents in the situation if it is regarding your family, bro. We got the two of cups in reverse. This is just so connected, bro, imbalance and so connected, bro. Y'all could not be speaking right now. Um, it's broken communication type of energy to me, bro. So I guess these could be lower level soulmates, bro, to be honest, nigga. Not even in that way, bro. I'm talking about like your mother could be a lower level soulmate of yours, bro. And in this case, with whoever the fuck this is over here, it could be dealing with some shit like that. We got a tower in the verse, bro. And that's more like, you know, you avoided the disaster, bro. I feel like someone in this situation, like your mother and your father, bro, King of Pentacles and fucking reverse, bro. You know what I mean? Uh, your motherfucker's trying to avoid a tower, bro, by not telling the truth, bro. They're trying to avoid misfortune as well, bro. But they're still not telling the truth, but these niggas got no options, nigga, at all, bro. The fuck was I even clarifying, nigga? Um, maybe I was looking at the page of wands when I was doing that, so maybe it's doing that. But uh, yeah, we got Scorpio energy, Aries energy out here, bro. Take that shit as you may, my nigga. Um, uh, with the tower, bro. That's for me. I don't know what it is for other people, bro. Um, but that seven of cups, bro. Really looking at me like niggas ain't got no more options in the situation, bro. I feel like these. Like, your mother was working real hard on some bullshit, bro. Um, <laughs> or, look, somebody wants to work on balancing out the situation with you. Okay. Okay. But it's a queen of coins in reverse, which means they're codependent on you, bro. This, yeah, it's your family, nigga. It's your mother and father, bro. If you have them in your life, bro, if you're adopted, then it's the other mother. It's them motherfuckers, bro. If you know what I mean? If you were raised by your aunt, your grandmother, it's that motherfucker, bro. It could be an abundance of people, like five people. I see four people for some of y'all. We got seven out here, bro. I mean, take that shit as you fucking made, dog. We got nine out of this bitch. Um, which makes me want to... Never mind. We got motherfucking... Um, what's that? April 5th. We got May 4th out here. Yeah, I'm going to grab this deck now because it's some bullshit. We got the motherfucking... Um, sorry, not... August 4th, bro. April 8th out here, bro. Go figure, nigga. We got... <laughs> Uh, February 7th, we got July 2nd out here, bro. We also have September 2nd out here, bro. All right, we're going to keep that shit fucking. Nah, I mean, we ain't got, I mean, yeah, I just ran through that little situation right there, bro. And then, like, the way I'm seeing this nigga, look, yo. Um, I said, who is this, right? Boom. This King of Pentacles in reverse energy, if this is 4444, this is regard to stability, bro. Um, but I'm saying, though, nigga, 
Joe Peoples had a hollow victory in regards to all of that shit, bro. Just in general, bro. As a matter of fact, give me this motherfucker, give me this motherfucker, bro. Because, I mean, this, look, yo. Like, what I was just saying, this two of cups in reverse, like, all of that shit, I feel like, hold on, hold on, hold on. The seven of cups in reverse, I feel like that's going astray. This is lost, nigga. Indecision. This person was being indecisive, bro, but these are fickle and wishy-washy people if I'm pretending it to your mother and father, bro. Um, this is like a purpose. I mean, like a purpose in that end action, bro. You see, they're trying to fuck with me, bro. I told y'all that at the beginning, bro. Oh, um, it is what it is, though, bro. Who gives a fuck, nigga? Like, that doesn't stop. Like, yo, I just need to understand that doesn't make me seem any dumber to my collective of people who watch me, period, nigga. It's not stopping shit you do, bro. And every time I catch it, I'm going to say it, bitch. Like, what the fuck? <laughs> Anyways, nigga, bro. Yeah, this motherfucker lost, nigga. Lost ass bitch. Cause you avoided the tower from there to see and shit like that, bro. Um, this is misfortune, bro. In the reverse, this is death to me too, bro. So hold on, I got y'all niggas, bro. The tower in reverse. I just feel like at the end of the day, bro, this is something that can't be rekindled, bro. On some shit, bro. At least with the tower being the outright, you can build something back from that. In reverse, I, I don't really see that happening, bro. I mean, that could be in both situations as far as I'm fucking concerned, bro. Um, you got this. If y'all can hear them, bitch. Sirens, people going to motherfucking jail. Anyways, yeah, bro, they're going to take a swift ass trip to motherfucking jail. So they want to, um, look, and you go get a second chance in money from that shit, you're going to be able to build your happy home. I'm pretty sure I said that. We got death coming out twice, though. Not the car, but I'm saying death energy for me, at least, bro. So this could be regarding death, some type of inheritance, bro. And uh, your parents work together to either keep it from you or to, you know, whatever, bro. They could have offered you. I mean, they could have wanted to offer you for or get you locked up for it. Facts. Um, if it was regarding anything, they could have, like, yeah, whatever, bro. Yeah, these niggas are dissatisfied. Like, this shit is ridiculous, nigga. This shit damn sure ridiculous. Uh, what, what the fuck? Yeah, nah. Hold on. Yeah, because I'm saying, though, in regards to this uh romantic interest little person, bro, that listen to their friends and shit over here, bro, wanted to go, you know what I mean, and shit like that, bro. Um, this person. Like, yeah, bro, this person was lovesick over there. Husband and wife, bro. I feel like this person's not committal, though. I feel like that's the energy from that King of Pentacles in reverse, bro. Because this is long term commitment, bro. I mean, you know, right, bro. Um, and we already got that out of the way with the short term affair energy and shit like that. So, yeah, you seen right through that type of energy from that person. Not like they probably didn't even come off on no shit. At like, they were just trying to fucking nothing. They wanted you to chase them down type shit, bro. That's the energy I'm feeling. Hold on. Uh, what's the current energy of this Queen of Coins in reverse, bro? Because I'm... Oh, shit. Oh, damn, bro. Let me go ahead and... Oh. You got a Queen of Wands in reverse, my name. Both of these are gossip energies, bro, for me, bro. You got whole-ass energy, bro. So, this person could be a thotty or, you know, a fuckboy, bro. You know what I mean? Take that shit as you may, bro. Um, whomever this is, bro. And they could have been, um, yeah, someone from their past, bro. They could have been someone from their past, bro. Could have been a fire sign, but it doesn't have to be, bro. Um, this person's feeling hopeless, bro. Because they didn't give you an offer, bro. I feel like, oh, bitch. Okay, they're arguing. Okay, they're arguing because it... Okay, bro. They're arguing with this person, bro. Or these people, bro. The current energy, I said the current energy of this Queen of Coins in reverse and Queen of Wands in reverse came out, bro. And then we got this person feeling hopeless and probably not healing, bro. Yeah, this is that ass energy, though. Take that shit as you may, bro. Um, and the person.
I didn't offer to you, bro. Instead, instead, bro, they were defensive towards you, and y'all probably had an argument and shit. And I feel like you dumped the cup out for this motherfucker. That came out with this Queen of Wands shit, so I feel like the Queen of Coins energy is dumping out the cup for that Queen of Wands energy, bro. You're not helping this person out anymore if that's the case, bro. Or your mother, bro, and this could be a sibling to you, bro, <laughs> who's a dumb bitch ass. Yeah, bro. So now they're not fucking with this individual. They're arguing and shit, bro. And your mother figure is trying to gain the strength, bro, to, uh, you know, have happy, you know, try to get a happy relationship with you, bro. Facts, bro. I'm dead ass serious, bro. They are in personal regret, bro. But they're trying to gain the strength, bro. No bullshit, bro. <laughs> Oh my gosh. Give me this shit. Oh, yeah, to bring you the truth. That would be the best thing for you to do, my nigga, bro. I already told y'all in like a past video, bro. I don't even know if it was in the video where I was showing my face or not, nigga. Um, that person in my life, motherfucking, came to me in a dream, bro. Like months and months before I started even doing, you know, the channel and shit. Crying, you know, crying their eyes out, begging for my forgiveness in the motherfucker. I mean, it wasn't a dream, it was a vision, bro. Or that person probably astral traveled to me to do that. Or that was probably a premonition, nigga. I don't know, I don't give a fuck, bitch. At least I knew it was coming, nigga. So bring your dumb ass so we can get this shit the fuck over it, bro. I ain't got time, bro. Come on, cuz. You either coming or you're not, bitch. Dark ass, you fucking dark bitch. <laughs> fuck. You better bring that truth, bitch. I mean, it ain't, it ain't really shit you could do at this point, bro. Like, that's what these people don't understand. For all this time that they were mad at you and did all this dumb ass shit, nigga. For, for facts, though. And did all this shit, bro. There won't nothing that you can do to help these niggas anyway. Y'all did it, bitch. Even, bro. It ain't no dropping charges when you done did some federal shit, bitch. Y'all are done, nigga. What the fuck? Getting the collective out of here won't do shit for you either way. Doing stop court spells and all that dumb ass shit, nigga. What is that supposed to do, bro? And stop, like, yeah, stop justice spells, but they be doing, like, because you can only hold energy, bro. You can't really just stop the energy. You can only hold it. So they're trying to do, like, you know, uh, like, holding court dates. So this shit, like, I don't know, bro. I'm trying to, trying to, uh, get it right, but it's late as a bitch, as y'all know. Give me this shit again, bro. This motherfucker going to jail, as I said, dog. I'm sorry to say it, nigga. Sorry to say it, nigga. Also, for this romantic interest, though, I feel like this person, um, the Queen of Coins energy, bro, that could be their husband or wife, right? And I feel like maybe this person isn't even non committal in that base, bro. I just feel like they're not committed to this person no more, or they're not in a stable relationship with that person. They could be together, and they're not in no stable relationship, bro. And in their partner's energy, bro, they're karmic. Or whatever this person can be coming too far like give a fuck and you know what i mean whatever bro um yeah bro you got the queen of wands energy in the reverse yeah this person's like a hoe and thought ass energy blah 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 i feel like i feel like bro from what i you know what i mean pull for this for the romantic interest though this motherfucker uh <laughs> either they have someone else in energy like these are two different people that queen of wands in reverse and and they're, and they're like arguing now because they told them not to give you this offer, bro. And they were forcing this person to not heal and shit like that, bro. Aquarius energy, take that shit as you may. It don't matter, bro. Who gives a fuck? Um, hold on, hold on. Because <laughs> this shit all over the place, bro. 53, 53, bro. Um, they didn't want this person to move forward. They were keeping this person stagnant. There we go. That's what I was saying, bro. And this could be these motherfuckers. Or one of them, you feel me, bro? Um, if it's pertaining to the friends in general, bro, I feel like, yeah, that the, the wife energy was sleeping, or the husband, bro, right? Was sleeping with their friend, nigga, and we got that out of the way, nigga. They're a promiscuous individual, bro. I just feel like, whatever, bro, they try to project that energy on you, though, they friends and shit, when at least one of them was probably fucking a person, bro, real shit, bro. Um, whatever, nigga, anyways. Hold on. Faithlessness, nigga, dirty, dire shit, bro. Feeling uninspired, lost hope. Yeah, so insecurity, bro. Yeah, they call this person to be insecure in, in many types of ways, bro. They probably talk down to this person. Yeah, this person's abusive as fuck, whether they're male or female, 
on, bro. Whoever they're dealing with is abusive as hell. They was keeping this person from healing, period, bro. So that's why they won't bring you no offer and they won't learn no lessons. The pages and coins and um, the reverse is just stupid. You know what I mean? To be honest, this could be a whole little fucked up family that was involved with the child, too. You feel what I'm saying? I feel like at, as well, bro, their, their spouse, bro, or their person, whoever they with, right? If that person is lazy, obsessive, nigga, they're obsessed with this individual, especially on that shit. Probably obsessed with arguing with this motherfucker or some dumbass shit like that, bro, to keep it a bean, nigga. This is chaos conflict, nigga. Take shit as you made, like what I said about the friends, too, though. They causing all that shit, too. If they did, if they partnered did, or if one of their friends slept with their partner on some dumbass shit like that, bro, then they're arguing about that currently, bro. If that has came out, um, it just came out for some people, bro. It is what it is, bitch. Uh, anyways, nigga. We got files out here. It's change coming in the situation, bro. Someone could be 55 in this situation, bro. Uh, we got August 5th out there, bitch. We got May 8th. Anyways, nigga. Uh, we got the 17th of any month, nigga. We got, uh, what's that? May 17th, nigga. July 15th could be significant. July 18th, nigga. August 17th. Take it as you may. Y'all could be a birthday or a date that something happened, nigga. Um, but yes, now this person wants to, they're arguing because they want to come out of the cold with you, bro. Pretty much, bro. This person's in personal regret energy and they're trying to get their experience back. Like, they probably on the surface, bro, it, acting like everything is fine, nigga, trying to, you know, hone that in the stream to go, you know, whatever, bro. But this card in particular, bro, in this deck, is confrontation with other people, bro. So they're trying to remain strong in the situation. I feel like this person wants to bring you some type of truth, though. Honestly, bro. They want to speak their truth, or they probably did, or they're probably going to, or whatever the fucking case, bro. Somehow the truth might have came out. It could have been while they were out partying and shit like that. I can read that. They, that got that shit out the way. Um, 56, 56, bro. This is your person, bro. Or at least this person may feel like that, bro. Um, it could be your twin, bro. But I don't even like saying shit like that no more. I just say it like that to base it for y'all, for one. Um. Yeah, some of y'all really like those little terms and shit. I'm not judging you, uh, but yeah. So that's that's pretty much what's going on. The person wants to bring you the truth, bro. Uh, this person being cold towards these people, bro. He probably cutting off, or she is probably cutting off these individuals and shit. Like they're going through a lot of chaos in their life right now, bro. Dealing with these individuals, whether that's two different people, or it's this one fucking like their person is fucking abusive, nigga. And their friends could have just. Made that person be stuck in their head. And now this person dissatisfied because they didn't make a move when they should have made a move. Like, they just be thinking they window opportunity last lifetimes and shit. No, bitch. It was there, nigga. And that was not, nigga. But I feel like as well, bro, they're not helping out this person anymore. And they might be, I mean, arguing about that. Excuse me. Like, uh, you know, the person that wants to come towards you or whatever probably want to bring you a truth about all this shit. I don't want to bring truth about all this shit. Yeah, bro. Uh, going through that whole situation uh, is causing a lot of, like, they're not helping out that person no more. They're not giving that person no help in here, nigga. It's just pretty much dead for that situation. That could be causing a lot of problems. Um, and the child could definitely be involved in this situation where their uh, person is trying to use the child against them. Or some shit like that. But... Your situation, bro, I'm saying, bro, with the mother figure of yours, bro, 58, 58, bro, what's that, 13? So, yeah, this is regarding your stability or even theirs, nigga. You got your, your, uh, like, this could be a sibling, bro, or a cousin, whatever the fuck, but it's with the mother figure. It could be an aunt and a cousin, bro. It could be your mother and your sister, brother, whatever the fuck. It's a sibling and a parental figure, bro, period. Or, you know, whatever the fuck, nigga, like, yeah, bro. And these energies, bro, these people are arguing now, bro. They, they have no more hope, bro, which y'all shouldn't. So why the fuck is y'all still throwing magic? I don't understand, nigga. It keeps returning for a reason, bro. Like, y'all literally see me on these videos. I'm talking about the bitches that's throwing this magic. Y'all see me up here, send it back, and I'm pretty sure y'all get it right back, bro. Leave me the fuck alone. Leave my collective alone, bitch. We protect them, nigga. Do you not know what that is, nigga? Do you not know what that is, bro? Of course not. Of course not. Duh, bitch. <laughs> like... Trying to like, you know what I mean? That's me, bro. I put myself in other people's shoes just to make sure I understand, bro. But some things aren't even worth doing that for to keep it a bean. Anyways, so uh, the motherfucker's going to jail, though. Yeah, bro. That's that's just pretty much that, bro. And, 
and the situation with your people is in this shit, bro. I feel like they're arguing about not giving you this shit. Or just a simple fact, bro. They're, they're lazy and greedy and all that shit. I did, I did say that your mother figure might be cutting off your your sibling though, or whoever the fuck you know who this is. You know what I mean? It might be cutting that person off, bro, because they didn't give you something that you were supposed to get. Uh, or as well, bro, to keep it a full stack, nigga. Um, it could be because of a child, bro. Like if you have a niece and nephew, or if you, you know what I mean, got a child involved in that shit, bro. That shit could be causing big uproars, bro. Which I told your stupid ass to get my niece away from that bitch. But anyways, bro. Fuck, bro. <laughs> but yeah, niggas is regretting shit now, nigga. They're, they're regretting doing all this shit. They're regretting holding this shit back from you, being lazy, being obsessed, being. Hold on. Because this in the reverse page, I think that's. Or is that the knife? Yeah, that's the knife for me. Oh, bro. Whatever, bro. Page of coins in the reverse, bro. That's lack of commitment, bro. Greedy, laziness, bro. Plans going to rob, bro. This person is non committal, bro. As far as their their spouse, like as far as, far as the romantic interest, their spouse is not committal, bro. And they and they fuck one of their friends, bro. Facts, nigga. And if you're watching, bitch, yeah, that happened. <laughs> uh, anyways, and in the other situation, yeah, bro. These people aren't like they probably snake each other. Like that's what I'm saying. It's no honor amongst thieves, nigga. They would throw each other under the bus, bro. I wonder who go snitch on who, bitch. Like facts, bro. Like that's pretty much that. Anyways, nigga, this person isn't help. Like your mother figure can't. Possibly is not helping this dumb motherfucker <laughs> over here with with the plan anymore. That's what I'm trying to say, bro. That's what I'm trying to say, bro. Then you got, let's see, current uh, energy of this king of pentacles in reverse, bro. This motherfucker feel like they got no more options, bro. Okay, nigga. And this is, no, this, this motherfucker right here, I feel like they're in the reverse just speaking in the facts of, um, maybe they... It came out with this little spread, so I feel like. Hold on, I got you. Hold on. The person was lost in the fog, pretty much, bro. They had their head in the clouds in the situation, bro. Probably had a lot of options in front of them. They didn't know what the fuck was going on with that. Uh, we got the Ace of Swords being in reverse, so it could have been regarding like their misfortune, bro. It could have felt like they, oh, they could have felt like they needed to avoid a tower. Or they were stalling the ending, right, of some sort, bro, because they didn't want to go into misfortune by leaving this, like, this this little, uh, this shit was actually this shit, first of all, bro, but I feel like, because it's coming out with, you know, how I lined it up and shit, and I'm just now noticing it, like, it's like this, so boom, boom, like that, and it's misfortune and a happy home. Do you get what I'm saying, bro? Um, so, yeah, bro, that's how I'm seeing that shit, and then that's why they felt like they had no option. But to cut you off and to cause this imbalance between a real soul connection with you. Then you got, then you got, nigga, your father figure, bro. Yeah, bro. It's not like they had no other option but to do the same thing, pretty much. I ain't even gonna lie, bro. They won't tell them the truth in the situation, but they had no choice but to not tell the truth. Or this person felt like that to you in regards to still being with the muscle. Or just in regards to everything like that. Like, this person probably has distanced themselves all the way from you. Type shit. Probably haven't heard from them in a minute. And, well, not even heard from them. You probably ain't even seen the motherfucker in a minute for a lot of y'all. That's what's good. You know what I mean? Motherfuckers should be getting their shit together. And I think that's what they're planning on might be doing. But I just pulled the current energy for this person. It's the will of fortune and love, right? So this person could be an energy of receiving some type of good karma. I don't really see it like that, bro. Hold on, I got you, bro. It's right here. Okay. They're cutting off this bad marriage. So they, they're in the energy of doing that currently. I said current energy, bro. This is the this is the merry motherfucking interest, <laughs> I guess, bro. Yeah, bro. Look, okay, bro. They're resting the healing, bro. Get right, bro. Get right, bro. I feel like that person had morals and values like a lot of y'all do as far as like, I need to stay with the person I motherfucking had kids with, blah, blah, blah. No, you don't, motherfucker, bro. God damn. Like, yo, if you're not happy with that person, bro, your kids can feel the energy, bro. Like, how is that helping your kid, bro? It's not. Just understand that, bro. Before you want to make a unconsciously selfish ass decision because you really want a motherfucker there. <laughs> yeah, you ain't healed. You need to. Anyways, look. 
Not a source of energy. All right, bro. That could definitely, like, yeah, bro. This is legal energy, bro. Cutting off this bad marriage. That higher feeling in reverse, bro. That could be this person over here. Like, they, I think I've already said that too on the read, bro, where this person's uh, spouse, bro. It's like some type of false ass, like, some type of false ass religious person and shit like that, bro. Like, that person that probably acts very religious, but they be around sleeping with a lot of people doing shit like that, was cheating on this motherfucker. Then you got motherfucking this, uh, oh, I feel like, yeah, bro, they kind of this bad situation, bro. I feel like, bro, because, yeah, the healing and the, you know I mean, all that shit, bro, this person could be, yeah, all right, bro. They're resting from this betrayal, yes, for sure, and they're healing from it. And I think, yeah, I, I said that, bro. This person could need some type of help, though, to be real, bro. The Ten of Wands in reverse came out right before the Six of uh, Wands. I mean, Six of Coins, what the fuck? <laughs> but that's victory. That's the reason I said it, bro. They want to get this victory ready, bro. I feel like the Ten of Wands in reverse, bro, that's dead. You know what I mean? In some cases, but I'm feeling that for you. Feeling trying, like, look, your father figure, right? They are trying to, hold on, this is the Wheel of Fortune, right? They see you ain't good fortune, bro, so what they're about to try to do is tell the, bro, oh, shit, your pops might be snitching, bro. <laughs> they might be bringing the truth about this false ass shit that was done in the government system, bro. They might tell you. I feel like people might be coming to, bro, bring you the truth so they can get Cause, bro, like, damn. Because everybody want to heal a situation with you. I feel like a lot of these people are just straight. I don't know. A lot of people got possessed, bro. I ain't gonna lie because niggas won't live in their lives right, bro. Facts, bro. And that's something to really consider. But at the same time, bro, if they were able to be possessed, bro, you got to see energy that you might want to stay away from them and just keep it a beam, bro. What the fuck? Who the fuck? What? Anyways, look, though. Um, just, like, yo... Pops wants to heal the situation with you, bro. But this motherfucker might, bro. I feel like they might try to, nigga. They might try to play on your spirituality or some shit, bro. Hold on, cause that's about to piss me off. I ain't gonna lie. We got Aquarius energy, Taurus energy, bro. Take that shit as you may, nigga. Cause this is wicked energy to me, bro. Like this is just false ass. Like, yeah, they're going to be trying to use God to... <laughs> bro. Bro, they... Yeah, nah, bro. For real, though. And they're contemplating doing that shit. No bullshit. They're contemplating how to do that. Um, I feel like, hold on, four swords and all right. Niggas dumb as fuck, bro. Recuperation, recovery, contemplation, and solitude, time out, rest. Restoration, bro. Yeah, they want to restore the connection with you, bro. But they about to come try to be on some false ass. Like, this is quick communication, bro. Fast communication, bro. That's what this person wants to bring you, right? Right? But this going to be some fake ass. I don't think they're going to bring you the truth about this shit. Ace of Swords and Reverses right here. Facts. That's just that. Um, and this person about to go to jail. I'm not even going to lie. Your pops is going to jail. If you are connected to your pops, nigga, or whatever father figure that may be, it could be an uncle, bro. Facts, nigga. Um, nigga, it could be both for a lot of y'all, bro. Anyways. Take this shit. Um, yeah, they're going to try to avoid the tire by lying to you because they don't have no other options. That's your father figure, bro. And as far as, like I said, with the romantic interest, that person felt like they had to lie to you, bro, and they had no other option to do that because... They didn't want, yeah, they were trying to stall an ending to y'all connection, which was in the upright at first, of course, naturally, when you met the motherfucker, but it ended up going in the reverse from this person lying to you. As far as the romantic interest, yes. Thank you, God, for that. Sorry for the uh, confusion in the first part of the read. If I did confuse anybody, but I, I'm getting it, or I got it now, but whatever. Uh, yeah, bro, this person about to go to jail, bro. <laughs> Facts, bro. But yeah, no, this person in debt and they need help. 
once again, this person could be going to prison. I feel like they could also be, bro, having lots of nightmares while they sleep and shit, bro. I ain't never really peeped this shit, but it's like, it's smoke. It's smoke on the side right there, bro. Like, you know what I mean? I'm just, dream state energy, bro, to me, bro. They probably, uh, dream about a betrayal, to be honest, bro. Having nightmares about all this dumb ass shit, bro. Uh, but this is a new beginning, bro, to be honest, bro. Honestly, bro, I'm going to tell y'all niggas something, bro. Hold on, turn the wine. Feeling way down, overstressed, bro. This motherfucker might be so overstressed that it might give you your shit. If this, is, if this person has it. Whatever it is. <laughs> Whatever it is, bro. So that this person doesn't go to jail. And, yeah, bro, they, your mother figure over here arguing with... This bitch, your, your uh, sibling or whoever the fuck this is, nigga. Because <laughs> they didn't give you some shit that was yours. Like, bro, I'm telling you, bro, for a lot of y'all, bro, y'all got some shit coming from both sides of the family, bro. Cause you're, like, bro, you are, you are the chosen one, nigga. You are that nigga, bro. You be getting, like, these people be knowing about Terrell, be probably going to psychics. Been, been going to psychics on your ass for a long time, bro. They knew all this shit was going to happen, bro. Everybody better come try to balance shit out with I feel like these people were being very patient on the shit that they was work like all the people that they was working on, and then look patiently working, patiently waiting, watching they watching the seeds they planted, bro. As far as you know, leaving you out in the cold, all that shit, bro. Facts, nigga. But I also feel like they see you planting your seeds while you got in the first part, bro. Look, these people don't want no smoke now. And I feel like this is for everybody in this family situation because I'm about to run about. They are on the code. They're spending some money losses and shit like that. I feel like they want to make a truce with you, bro, because they're going to be experiencing hella money losses, bro. Big losses in their motherfucking life, bro. What you fucking deserve, bro. All y'all, bro. No bullshit, bro. This person, uh, uh, fucking five of wands in reverse, bro. Avoiding conflict. You know I mean, internal battles and shit. I feel like there's romantic interest in going through an internal battle, bro, because you left them out on the code, bro. But they want to balance the situation out with you for sure, bro. They do want to travel towards you, bro. Uh, cancer could be involved in this family situation. That could be the mother figure or the father. Who gives a fuck anyway? Look, they want to travel towards you, and uh, it's a second chance of money, bro. I feel like these are people. They want to, uh, you know what I mean? Whatever, nigga. But they were holding it on to it, bro. Said that. I feel like that chair energy it means like these motherfuckers is going to jail. For holding back that second chance of money for you or trying to stall it coming to you, bro. Because for a lot of y'all, that's what they were exactly what they were trying to do or doing. Stalling it coming to you, bro. Or simply just holding on to some shit that you can't hold on to, bro. You were trying to be controlling, bro. Abusive, bro. Shit like that, bro. People crazy, bro. <laughs> no bullshit, bro. Um I feel like I feel like this person, like the romantic interest. <clears throat> it's stalling because they don't feel confident enough to come towards you. They do want this successful, like, marriage situation with you, and they definitely want to travel towards you, bro. But they can feel like they stabbed you in the back, bro. Facts, nigga. Facts. You got judgment, bro. The person getting judged. Like, the people uh, getting judged for the shit that they did, bro. Judgment, I was like, also, hold on. That Scorpio energy for me, so take this shit as you may, my nigga. Uh, someone in the situation could be a Scorpio. I ain't really get much of that energy. Unless, if you do pretend to this past person, because there are people in your past, it, it could be, like, if I'm pretending this to, like, the person who a lot of y'all would consider your twin, that you ain't fucking with no more, blah, 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 you want to move forward from, blah, blah, blah. This person definitely wants to come bring you the truth about their mother figure. That was, a, you know what I mean? For a lot of y'all, this person promised their mother that they would not fuck with you no more, bro. And that was that, like, promising they wouldn't hit you up or none of that shit. And that's why this person did not contact you at all, bro. That was that. That was pretty much that. Um, for the for all the other reasons involved with all of that, bro, uh, we'll have reads for specifically that person in the future, bro. I got y'all on that. Because I know some of y'all are like, well, yeah, we do want to kind of hear about that. But it is what it is. I feel like, bro, you, judgment for the Queen of Cups and all right, bro. As far as like the justice system shit, bro, the judge, the ruling is in your favor. <laughs> Facts, nigga. You're getting victory, bro. Six of wands and all right. This judgment, bro, with the justice system, bro, these people going to jail, nigga. 
and your nurturing, good, loving ass is getting victory in this system. You can be in the public eye. It don't really matter, but I feel like these people are judging you based off your, you know, fit in the public eye, bro. I feel like you got a Cancer Pisces Scorpio energy, though. Um, you know, male or female, take that shit as you may, bro. That's very nurturing, wants to nurture a connection with you, wants to nurture the situation with you. I feel like this person may have betrayed you in the past, and this could be your past person. I don't know what I'm saying that, bro. We got death coming out of right, bro. Um, just a change, transformation. This person wants to change the situation with you, or they are transforming within the situation. Yeah, this is definitely now the past since this energy is coming out now. Um, or, you know, the twin, whatever the fuck. Yeah, this motherfucker, bro. Definitely could be a Scorpio or have the holiday aspect of the chart, bro. But this person is um, calling. This is a, pi a pivotal decision and shit, bro. This is awakening, bro. This person, yo, twin, or whatever the fuck you call them, is finally fucking awakening. Yes, bro. That person is finally awakening. But as well as this married motherfucker or the person who's getting out of that and all that funny ass shit, right? This motherfucker. Matter of fact, yo, this past energy, bro, could be arguing with your peoples, bro. No bullshit, bro, because they were involved in this situation. Best believe, yes, they were, bro. Uh, but this person's about to come for me and tell you that shit. I feel like, bro, they're all arguing because they don't know who about to take the fall for this shit. I'm, a, uh, I'm nigga, I'm really about to call this who gonna snitch? Who snitching on who? Who snitching first? <laughs> who snitching first? Because in this situation, bro, Especially with like this romantic interest and in their friends over here and shit like that that they wanted to go party with and shit and they still left them depressed as fuck. Dumbass. That's what they doing. Or that's what they was doing, bro. Trying to drink the depression away from all the shit. Focusing on the past hurt too much and shit like that. As far as like the married motherfucker, they was thinking about the betrayal from their husband or wife. You know what I mean? Too much, bro. And they weren't really in the mind to fuck with you like that. They didn't want to build no long, you know, solid connection at first. But now they do. You feel me? They want to come clean that they're heartbroken, bro. Both of these individuals too, bro. And they want to change the situation with you, bro. Both romantic interests. And yeah, that's that. Um, they do. They want to nurture this connection with you, bro. They want to build a solid offer, bro. One or one or both of these kids could. I mean, one or both of the yeah, little fucking kids. Yeah, one of these motherfucking people can have kids, bro. One or both, bro. Your past person, if that person didn't have kids. Having a kid, bro. They want to bring you the truth about that dumb ass shit, too. Not dumb. Every kid is a blessing for sure, bro. But yeah, bro, they want to be morally right now. They want to stand in their good energy as far as that, bro. No bullshit. I feel like also um, for this, for the person with the marriage, like, merrily, bro. Here we go. This is marriage. This is heartbreak, nigga. They got, they want to bring you the truth about that. Um, also, but, but, but beware of, you know, being a rebound, for real, dog, because a lot of, yeah, nah, fuck that, nigga, you, you better know how you're coming and what you're coming with, my nigga. Oh, for sure, Yeah, bro, and the other, yeah, they gonna bring you the truth. Okay, they coming clean about the, yes, nigga, yeah, that's what the, yeah, this person about to come clean about the fucking marriage, bro, about their third party, bro. They are. Or at least they want to. They're becoming single from this person that they were married to. That's what they're about to, they want to tell you that. They're going to come clean and tell you that, bro. Cross watcher, do that shit, nigga. Like, I feel like at the end of the day, bro, take that shit as you may, bro. Uh, <laughs> yeah, take that shit as you may, because I ain't trying to tell y'all nothing that, or how to live y'all lives and shit, bro, but I feel like the truth is always the best fucking remedy for anything, bro. I feel like that's what's that, man. Um, I feel like we got pretty much the near future actions or whatever, bro. Oh, well. Yeah, we got what they want to do. Okay, that's what they want to do. Sorry, man. What's the near future actions for? I'm going to have to bring out the other deck again, my man. <laughs> I mean, we still got a lot of cards in this. Oh, shit. <laughs> got a trolley horse, my nigga. All right, now. Okay, now. See, we about to have all this coming to you, bro. And then at the same time, you're getting this message about this motherfucking money from, you know, them doing that dumb ass shit, bro. Look, bro. That we get hit, they get that justice system bullshit, bro. I'm telling you, bro. You're going to be able to move forward. Or because you move forward, nigga, these motherfuckers is anxiety, depressed, having sleepless nights, bro, over your new beginning, nigga. Facts, nigga. What the fuck?
fuck up, bro. This weak ass, this weak ass mother. You a bitch, nigga. You gonna stay a bitch, nigga, in jail. Nigga, you'll be a bitch in jail. This motherfucker is uninspired, bitch, I bet. Trying to stop you working, nigga. Trying to stop the cycle from being complete, bro. They're sitting there, sitting there planning and shit with your bitch ass. You a bitch, nigga. What's up, nigga? They're planning, they're plotting. You too, your nurture ass is too strong for that, bro. You're just too strong for it, bro. You too strong for it, bro. Walk away from that dumb ass shit. Go stop playing with me, bro. You out in the cold with your bitch ass, nigga. What you talking about, bro? Like, yo. Yeah, these mounted motherfuckers out there. I was just about to ask the, the Yeah, don't bring shit to Carmen Waters, bro. Don't. Because they're thieves. Okay? Okay. Thank you, Spirit, for that. Look, bro, they don't have no intuition. These are dark people doing dark magic on you, bro. We already said that. Look. They're experiencing they're doing conflict magic on your shit, bro. To get you to experience conflicts with people. That's probably man what? But they're experiencing conflicts because it backfired, bitch. Stop doing it with your stupid ass. Look, these people homes are unhappy. Home conflicts. Sending you conflict to your home, bro. Like, literally one after another. But they're experiencing that. I feel like also, my nigga, um, this people, I mean, this person was being sneak. You may not, okay, you walked away. Okay, sorry, y'all. My bad. My bad. You walked away from this uh, romantic interest, though, as far as the married motherfucker. Or even, or even the other motherfucker for some of y'all, bro, because... You had the strength, you know. You was you never stopped being this nurturing motherfucker, this good person. No, never that. But you walked away, right? Hold on. Let's see. Hold on. I'll just be tossing. I'll be throwing the goddamn cards, bro. It's the next thing. Okay, look, look, look. So you got this person. I feel like, like I said, bro, they just find you tempting the fuck, bro. They want to be attached to you, bro, but not in a bad way, bro. The devil in the upright is not always bad shit, y'all, bro. For anybody who... You got to feel that damn energy, bro. It just depends on the energy, bro, of the person and all that shit, bro. But yeah, bro, um, this person was being sneaky and shit in the past, bro, because they were having so much home conflicts in their life, my nigga. And plus, they were arguing with a lot of people around them probably too, bro. It was just a lot of bullshit. That's why this person was in and out. Like, you walked away because the person was in and out, bro. I feel like this person was in some devilish energy. I do feel that, yeah. But, yeah, you let this motherfucker out in the cold. Because they kept playing around. They come, come in and out your life, bro. And you ain't want to end up out in the cold. So, yeah, that's that, bro. Oh, um, look. So, yeah, bro. Yeah, you walked away, let the motherfucker out in the cold. You got me. So, you don't want to bring things in common waters or at least... Emotional baggage, yeah. You felt like this person had an emotional baggage, bro. But this person's also, like I said, bro, they're struggling to let go of you. Facts, bro. So they're planning. Like, yeah, like they had, they were being sneaky and shit in the past. Yeah, we got that, bro. They're being sneaky, not using their intuition and shit, bro. <clears throat> in regards to the whole situation, bro. But they're planning now. Yep. You were spying on your oh, ass, bro. Because they still got like a balance in their life. I feel like also, bro, this person just watching you and not traveling towards you. Yeah, they want to give you this love offer. They they just want the um, page of cups, princess of cups, but that's someone that wants forgiveness, bro. This person definitely wants forgiveness for, for juggling these situations, bro. Your other interest, bro, that that twin, whatever the fuck that. Yeah, bro. Since you saw the way it caused a tower in their life, bro. They weren't expecting that shit. I feel like the other person either won't expect you to walk away, but you did. The other person's, both of them, questioning their motivations for even fucking playing these games in the first place. The devil in the right, for me, nigga, is someone that plays way too fucking much. In both situations, bro. Pretty fucking much. Um, pretty much, bro. Your family is uh, questioning motivations. Like both of them are questionable motivations because they seen you as wish fulfillment. I swear to God, bro, both of them. Like, why the fuck did I even play those games? Why did I do all of that, bro? I could have had a happy ass family with this person and I knew it. Like this person, both of these people are intuitive. Just know that, bro. Just know that, bro. Both of them got intuition. Both of them knew what the fuck was going on, and they both 
both did that dumbass. You you were both you were saying that life has a granted wish. Look, bro, it was a foolish decision, bro. Stupid. Stupid. Them dumbass choices, bro. They instead, bro, they were manifesting with other people. They went and did other shit with other people instead. Pretty much energy that we got in the first part with this, you know, the married motherfucker. And then even with your past person. Now I'm pretty sure you know the scoop on that already, how that went. Left niggas in heart and they broke your heart and and, and broke their own heart, bro. Third parties. Let third parties get in the way of their happiness, bro. Facts. Both interests, bro. And it's always gonna be kind of like that because y'all got nothing, bro. It's just energy, bro. And for a lot of y'all, it's learning lessons and breaking cycles, bro. That's why it appears that way, bro. It's not a hard concept to understand whatsoever, bro. You want to come out the code? Oh, this person is experiencing personal regret. Both of them, though, bro. I feel like I'm pulling both of these niggas' energy. Both of them scared. To come after the successful marriage and all that shit. Just come travel to us and shit. Look, bro, that happens, bro. They want that cup, but they're afraid. Uh, there's more opportunity from you, bro. Look, bro. Bye bye. Expansion, successful marriage energy, bro. Empress energy, bro. All that shit, bro. Come on, bro. That's your justice, man. I feel like this is also someone bringing you to justice, though. Look, justice, victory. Get the fuck off the mountain. What's up? <laughs> What's up? Y'all yeah, niggas, bro. 26, 26, bro. You're, you're um, moving forward, bro. I feel like in regards to this family situation, I'm going to start it from the ten, of, um, the 10 of Cups. Your family has experienced a tower, bro. For trying to be attached to you and holding on to your shit. Trying to attach yourself to your shit. Wait, yeah, your family spends the time for trying to attach themselves to your shit, bro. And they were juggling both situations, trying to juggle your money or juggle whatever the fuck they were doing. They want to bring you some type of living offer. These people are all talk, manipulated, manipulators, bro. All that shit, bro. Yes, nigga. And beware of, beware of either one of these romantic interests just being all talk, bro. I feel like as far as the past person, no, this person has a lot of shit that they need to say and and be real about, bro. Plus, fuck words, nigga. What are you gonna do? Bitch, what's up, nigga? What the fuck you gonna do, bitch? Anyways, nigga, it was full of decisions to do all that dumbass shit with these motherfuckers, bro. To work with these dumbass motherfuckers, bro. Facts, nigga. I feel like, I feel like, nigga. Like I said, bro, manifesting with other people, bro. I feel like these, your family, bro. Hold on. Full of decisions trying to manifest your, what you were working on and shit like that. Like, basically your shit, bro. I feel like, hold on. Nigga, I just feel like this is weak magic. They were doing weak magic together, nigga. Working on some weak ass magic. To be real, bro. To leave you in heartache. And shit like that. I swear, bro. So now they're in personal regret. Niggas are scared as a bitch. Because someone is coming towards the Empress. And they know this already, bro. And it's not even someone. I feel like, like it's just, bro, this legal energy, bro, you're going to get hit. Your money, bro, and that's just like I said. Look, I don't even remember which way it came out, but fucking nigga, Ace of Coins, a new opportunity, bro. I mean, I feel like they, you know, what I mean, they upset about that too, whether it be in love or anything. But you're going to get an opportunity, like in your work, though, nigga. What you're working on, so keep working on it, y'all, bro. That's your justice, bro. And I feel like now nah, you're gonna get a message about money, period. Is it for me at least? The Ace of Coins is a message about money, bro, and it's being given to, to you. Nigga, so the justice system, bro. You're getting your justice. Not right, bro. And you're gonna be able to be moving forward from that. And I think I said this in a re a while back, bro. Like this shit is gonna put like when this all this shit blow over, play out, bro. But nigga, you gonna whatever you stressing about now as far as your pursuits and shit, bro. That's not gonna be a problem whatsoever, nigga. Stay calm, y'all. That's why I post that shit on my community tab for y'all. Look. Come on, bro. Victory for you, bro. Come on. Look. Queen of Swords on reverse, bro. Queen of Gemini energy. Take that shit as you may. They had a failed collaboration. For your dumb ass, bitch. Yeah, they did. Over it. <laughs> no, I'm sorry, bro. Like, look, bro. Page of cuss, nigga. You 
just want to, just want to apologize, but you're over it. Like I feel like this is just the family energy, bro. That queen of swords in reverse, but that's just cutting ass energy. I feel like you, you could be cutting in the energy of cutting niggas' heads off if they do want to step to you. That's how I'm seeing that, to be honest, bro. I know the queen of swords in reverse is like dark magic energy and shit. I feel like also the people were doing dark magic energy so that people rejected you. They didn't want your cup if you were giving out love to people, bro. You know what I mean? And so that you didn't get offers and shit. Facts. But I feel like you're also in that energy of just like, yeah, fuck it. Fuck you. Fuck that. What the hell? Because <laughs> you big boss. Big boss. Oh, fuck. Come on, bro. It don't really matter, bro. I'm just, just saying, bro. Just say whatever the fuck y'all want, bro. Y'all can judge all day. Your opinion does not matter to a fact. Like, I mean... That's that, bro. Your opinion can matter to you all damn day. It don't fucking matter, bro. Not as well. You're jealous, bro. Over your legacy, bro. Facts, bro. Your great fortune, bro. That's that, bro. Bro, niggas is sad. Sleepless nights, bro. And I already think I already got that shit over your new beginning, bro. Fear, anxiety, stress the fuck out. Not, bro, jealous. Braddy energy, just look, look, it just keeps saying that look, bro. These are the ops. Ops mad, bro, because they because it didn't work. You still defend standing your ground, defending yourself. <laughs> through the bullshit, through all this shit. These people are going to jail, bro. I'm gonna keep it a bean, bro. There was no right choice. Less or two evil, bro. I feel like they, these motherfuckers are the lesser two evils in your life, collective, bro. Y'all are fine, bro. Keep being grateful, juggling that motherfucking coin, bro. And your home life and all that shit, bro. You have a new opportunity coming towards you, bro. Fuck all that, bro. I was shot, nigga. It's 1.31, bro. Uh, what time is it? Nah, I was saying, like, the time of how long I've been doing it. Uh, what's up, bro? Should I... I mean, I already got pretty much everything, bro. All right, we're going to pull the true intentions of... Man, fuck it. Man, I ain't even going to do it. Because I'm like, shit, bro. I ain't use these cards like that. Uh, what's the near future actions for uh, the Mary motherfucker, bro? Look. What's the near future actions for the Mary motherfucker? 32, 32. Change energy, come on, bro. Because you're still having trouble speaking up, speaking the truth, just like the um, top energy from, um, you know, when we started. Tell me why the same fucking cards. All right, bro. So this is definitely this motherfucker. Like that just confirms for y'all that I've been speaking the truth this entire. Got a five of swords and another cup, bro. In reverse. Got a five of swords and the upright. <laughs> right. Not a cups. In reverse, right. Guess what? Niggas could doubt my gifts all damn day. <laughs> I don't give a fuck. Anyways, bro. This person their future actions is this person taking losses, bro. But all is not lost. Cross rocks it for you, bro. They're going to take losses from the situation. They're going through it with people, bro. All that shit. I honestly do feel like though, like I'm just being real, bro. This cross office, bro. I, this is current energy, bro. The collective is like it seems like this person is uh, like not feeling too hot about you being content and shit like that. I feel like this person, um, I 
This person could end up becoming an op, bro, and being jealous of your shit, bro. I ain't even gonna lie, bro. I really like, but what I'm really fucking feeling is this person is traveling away, bro, because this is, you know, walking away energy, bro. Just being real, bro. They're walking away from these jealous people. Because, bro, I clarified the night of coast in reverse. Remember, bro, their friends came out. They're cutting off those people, bro, walking away from them. And they come to get this. They're going to be single from it at the very least, bro. I don't know if that pertains to you or not. So we're gonna fucking find out. Clarify them down the pinnacles in the reverse. Got a king of cups in reverse, bro. Um, you already know that's like emotional turbulence, emotionally manipulative energy, bro. But I don't necessarily mean to say that. That could be an alcoholic of any sort. I don't want to come right up and clarify that, bro. Yeah, bro. This person's gonna be. Single and shit, going through shit, bro. Drinking a lot, probably, bro. You got a devil in the right and a nine of wands in the right, so they're continuing this battle. The wounded warrior energy, bro. Hold on. Yeah, nine of wands in the right, bro. It's a sudden one for the money in my book, bro. I ain't gonna lie, bro. Uh, but everything is fine for this person, by the way. That's what I was. That's what I was trying to get. Everything's just fine for this person, bro. I feel like this person has attachments that they're fighting, bro. And it's leaving them in a state, bro, that, like, this person is going through their dark night of the soul, bro. They're separated from things, people that no longer serve them. They're, they feel like they're back and turned against the wall and shit, bro. And I feel like this person would need some type of healing. Or, you know, they want to heal with you. Okay, cool, bro. Cool, thank you. So yeah, they're, they're, that devil in their life is their spouse, bro. You got that, though. That person has dumped out the cup for that motherfucker, bro. That person's not fucking with that person. That's what it is. And they could still be on that drinking shit. They could still be feeling some type of way, bro. You got this betrayal in this shit, bro. Yes. Yeah. And then, yeah, but that person's going to stand their ground. I feel like that's what this person's doing. Especially in the near future actions, for that matter, bro. This person, this person could be getting the sudden west. I mean, sudden west all the money from you know that shit. If it is even breaching that damn long, you know what I mean. But yeah, bro. And this person's trying to keep stay attached to him, their spouse or whatever, bro. This person's planning on how to trick them, bro. Planning on how to cash illusions, bro. This person, bro, you got the Queen of Pentacles in the reverse, right? It's trying to ca cast illusion. Hold on, hold on. I got you. Hold on. They're feeling uninspired. They're not working. Uh, they might not work. I don't know why I just said that, but they might not work right now or whatever. They're trying to stall this person's progress, bro. Have this person um, feeling some type of stuff, bro, within their work situation and shit. This is um, lack of passion, feeling uninspired. They're trying to keep this person uninspired, bro. And illusions, uh, 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 you know what I mean? This person is working with their friend, bro. They, they're they working with this person to keep this person from moving forward, bro. Probably because of some money that this person may have, or you know, splitting from their marriage or whatever the case, bro. And they're playing with this motherfucker, bro, about giving an offer, or, or since I'm still pulling the energy of, um, you know, this person or whatever. Like, you know, the, the interest or whatever, this person could be feeling uninspired because the illusion didn't work, bro. And then and the two, oh, two of wands and the upright, bro. Uh, trying to run, make a decision. Leaving the home. Okay, yeah, that person's leaving. <laughs> that person's definitely leaving. That person's strategizing how to come towards you and bring you this offer. Yeah, okay. This person possessive over you. This person so on to you. I feel like also they're trying to work with like I, it was the reason why I came out. Like they're trying to work with their friend, not not the interest, but that the fucking spouse of the interest or whatever, or the you know boy, whatever the fuck nigga. That person is working with thirty nine thirty nine, bro. What's that? Yeah, they're 
They're lying, bro. They're trying to provide misguided communication and provide illusions around the whole situation so that this person can give to them, bro. Yeah, bro, can give right back to them, bro. But in tandem, this person is still, this person's walking away and they're coming towards your fine ass with an offer, bro. This person is possessive over your energy, bro. Um, they do want you really bad. Uh, this is a good advice conference. Yeah, long term stability. They want to build that with you. That's what this offer is going to be. Long term stability for your finance. This person's on honeymoon right now, bro. Trying to figure it out. And they're playing the stage, bro. This person, okay. This person might be in the energy of um, needing some help. You know what I mean? And that's why they're feeling a little insecure, bro. But they, the offer, they want to bring you more, like, because, okay, which one of these shits was, um, this shit, over critiquing yourself, bro. They feel like they don't have enough to bring you as far as this person. And this person does have something to bring, but they don't feel like it's enough for you. You feel what I'm saying? So it's cross watcher, bro. You can't you can't be worried about that, bro. Time waits on no one. Like I don't understand why, bro. You will still travel forward on that ass, bro. That's why they lose the strength too, because you're still moving forward on that ass, bro. They feel like they made the wrong decision. And that's fine, bro, but you got to get over that, bro. You got to make a move, bro. In their future actions, let me get the fuck out of here. In their future actions for uh, the, the twin, bro. You got the hermit in reverse, bro. You got the nine of swords in reverse, bro. The four cups in reverse. This person's thirsty over you, bro. But they have too much anxiety going on within them. Yeah, I mean, they're letting fear take over as far as reaching out to you, bro, because they've already rejected your offer. They feel like they're going to get rejected. They got to feel rejection. This got to feel rejection. But these motherfuckers isolating themselves too much, bro. It's doing more harm than good. Crosswatcher, twin, whatever, nigga. <laughs> doing you more harm than good, bro. You need, you got more of the, you know what I mean? I'm just saying, bro. Nigga, just sad, bro. Look, not a wise energy, bro. This person wants some time for being in and out, bro. This person does want to, um, this person might have to travel towards you, like over a body of water or some shit. Like y'all might be at a super distance from each other, shit like that, bro. Not the ones in reverse, bro. This person could just want to come, fuck. Like this person want to come and then leave because they are depressed. The fuck, cause you're not fucking with them. That's the situation. You ain't bringing in the convoy. You're not working on it with them. Like, bro, first of all, bitch. Oh my God, cause you about to get, yeah, yeah. I'm about to get right in that queen of swords on that dumb ass nigga, bro. I don't, bro. This dumb ass motherfucker, bro, you you need to, yo. Oh my God, I'm getting out of here, bro. Yeah, bro, judgment in reverse. You could be dealing with a Scorpio in this situation. You could be dealing with a Virgo in this situation, bro. It don't really matter. Niggas is bitches out here, bro. This person's in love with you heavy, bro. And this definitely could be a Scorpio with these coming out right, right after each other, bro. This person, if that person were to come back, yeah, they wouldn't mind fucking with you and being there with you and blah, 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 and this, that, and the third, right? But this person also doesn't want to, okay, wait, okay, we got the truth. Okay, look, okay, new beginning. Take that shit as you may. <laughs> I don't even think that's more so the truth, bro. This is goddamn hollow victories, bro. What that nigga dead was a hollow victory. What the bitch dead was a hollow victory, bro. This person could have ended up having another child on your way. King Cups is a person with a kid. So take that shit as you made. It might want to bring the truth about that. Who the fuck cares, bro? It's going to be an illusion, though. <laughs> or they could want to bring you the truth about the magic. Look, truth about the magic. <laughs> with the magician coming out right there. Mm-hmm. With the moon right there, that's moon magic. Nigga, you're doing moon rituals and shit. This person was probably doing moon rituals to get you back in their life. And guess what, bitch? That ain't working. Yeah, you know I mean, that's what I'm trying to say, bro. Y'all niggas sick as a bitch. You still moved on from that heartache from this dumb motherfucker, bro. This person didn't want you to walk away or move on from the heartache. And that's why they did the magic. I mean, but, but that's that's like self-explanatory, bitch. When you should have just picked up your phone and said, I'm like, matter of fact, I ain't gonna tell you what to say, bitch, because that's why you don't know what to say now with your stupid ass. What the fuck is wrong with you, bro? This person doesn't want this cycle to be complete. But like I said, this person doesn't want to take accountability for the, for what they did. They want to just come back. Time heals everything. Yeah, yeah, sure do. When you're healing, bitch. 
person wants you to drop your guard, but that's not what the fuck you're doing, bro. <laughs> you got victory news and a letter coming towards you, bro. Facts, nigga. It's not a towel. The emperor about to come clean. They about to come try to bring you some type of stability, but guess what, bro? It might come with some dark magic in it. I ain't gonna lie, bro. Or just some fact that this person's despair saying, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Because for a lot of y'all, it isn't that. And even to cross watchers, bro, I don't even mean to be coming at y'all like that. Because if you go complain about the magic you did, then it means it probably means that you're not doing it, but it probably might not. You know what I mean? I ain't gonna lie to you, bro. <laughs> it's goddamn. And feel like they got work without results in the situation of this dark magic, though. But this is this is your yeah, bro. What false flame? My nigga, fuck you mean, bro? <laughs> Person experiencing frustrations because they're still defensive, bro. Like they were sitting there watching you doing the magic for a, however long, right? Waiting for you to be in the energy where you want this person back, open up, look, bro. So you get 45, 45, bro, with them. The fuck, I'm getting out of here, bro. I'm getting out of here. This person sees you for who you are. Then, then, yeah, whatever, bro. They want to come out the code. Whatever, nigga. They want to move towards you, bro. They want to take this leave of faith. Fuck that. <laughs> yeah, bro. Yeah, bro. That, I'm getting the fuck out of here. I love y'all niggas so much, bro. Um, I hope y'all niggas have a good night, bro. Sleep well, bro. If this message fucking resonated with you, then please hit that like button on this video, bro. Subscribe if you have not, bro. Leave a link in the description if you, you know what I mean, want to pop with that or whatever, bro. I love y'all niggas, though. You already know what time it is. I catch y'all niggas.